Hello everyone, welcome back. I'm Raghavan Mishra, and in this video, we will learn how to write a Bash script to find the strings in file and replace those strings with other strings in the same file. We'll see how to use if condition in Bash script and how to check dollar question mark, which is written code of last executed statement, a last uh, executed command in Unix cell scripting. All right, with that, uh, let's go to terminal and see what all we have in this current directory. And let's create one uh, file called find and replace. So this is going to be my uh, script file. And uh, I'll start the script uh, with shebang line, which is nothing but the path of bash. And then I will have this is the script for find and replace string in a file all right so this is the equal statement and uh, um, just un under this statement i'll be trying to you know find uh, the string in the file say i'm trying to find mistra in some some of the file uh, let's say i have created one abc log which is there, which was there in my current directory or if it is there somewhere in uh, other path you can specify the path of that file okay so this might be uh, abc or whatever xyz so this might be a, a path okay so you have to specify the path of that okay since it is in current directory so you can specify like this or like this okay so i'll go with this and uh, we are expecting that misra is uh, there in this file okay so we are just trying to find with the grep command okay and in just below that uh, what you can mention you can write one if uh, statement wherein you can have dollar just mind you you have to keep some space over here and question mark dollar question mark okay and then you can mention zero 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 over here okay what it will uh, uh, i mean like uh, this is the condition basically so what we are expecting we are expecting if this mistra is found then i will allow uh, this control to get inside this is if statement or whatever is there inside this loop right uh, i mean will be executed okay so i'll simply put one a statement uh, and say inside or i will say mishra is found okay if it is not found or this text basically whatever we have mentioned over here if it is not found then i mean if it is actually not found here it will not match the string and it will not uh, come inside this okay i will close the uh, if statement with fee and i will save i will just give escape and colon x to save the contained whatever i have written right all the commands to save the file basically you have to use colon x okay i have saved it and now uh, i can execute this file and i mean it should be not file and replace find and replace right let me rename with the mv command so i will be replacing with this find and replace dot sh okay and if i give find and replace dot sh it will say permission denied so i have to use i have to give execute permission to this file okay fine and see it has changed the color to green it may be other color also based on your uh, setting of this uh, terminal but uh, you can see with ls ltr command okay so if it has uh, got the execute permission or not so see read write x is for user read write x is for read and execute for others read and execute is for group okay user group and others basically so uh, this is for others so i've given uh, execute permission to everyone on this file now if i execute ideally i mean this is that file 
you can use cat command to uh, see the content of abc.log and see something is here ishra or something is not so i will just change it okay but we are expecting uh, something right uh, with this i mean in this file this script file what we are expecting we are expecting mistra string to be present inside uh, this so it will not fi uh, find so it will not be allowed or control will not go into this if okay so this condition will not satisfy and the control will not come uh, here okay so we'll see uh, we'll execute find and see it has not uh, printed this statement okay but if i make change here abc log and if i go ahead and change it to mistra and then execute this then it will say mistra is found okay based on this condition so for now what i'll do actually i will just clear it with the clear command once again and then i will go ahead and what i will do i will uh, replace mistra with uh, raghav okay or raghavendra that is my name and uh, you can replace with uh, any string you want okay so this is another file and uh, find so uh, what i'll do i'll just uh, write one statement over here which is nothing but the set command and i will be using uh, yes and i'm expecting mistra to be replaced with uh, say as that adda okay and if i want to replace all the occurrences of mistra throughout the file in the in the file right so i'll be putting g options over here and in which file abc you have to specify the uh, uh, log file name also or txt or whatever right so i'll be just executing and uh, once again let's see the content of abc log abc is returning something this is okay so this is that the content of the file and after executing this script let's see if it is replacing the content or not so mistra is found but we have not um, uh, written some statement that this particular you know statement has been executed and it has uh, replaced on uh, this string with uh, with whatever we have uh, mentioned over there right as data data. so uh, we, we can just say we can just uh, take the output of this and see it has replaced okay so if you want to you know replace uh, this as data again or this with something you, you can uh, edit this file again and put one more statement over here okay similarly i mean like uh, and for that uh, how you will do that so simply uh, just uh, press double y to copy and just place the cursor over here put escape and shift p okay so this way you can copy paste uh, your you know uh, uh, string inside a v, uh, file okay so we have copied through uh, yy and we have placed the cursor where we want that content to be pasted and we will use shift and a p okay basically capital p to you know copy paste the to paste the content whatever we have copied and now we are we are actually replacing uh, this right with say raghav vend right so in the same file so this is how you can use multiple set statement and uh, you can use a um, line number or any other specific pattern or regex with um, say a set command <coughs> inside the script i will execute i will see just the content of this and now we are expecting now uh, that this will be replaced with the uh, ragvendra right so let me execute this script again and see it has not come uh, to that far because we have not you know the condition is not met what you would uh, you would do either you change the condition or you you know uh, uh, you actually go ahead and replace uh, some something in this file okay again you can change it to mistra or you can put some something like you can change the condition like if not 
if it is not found then I come inside this okay so yeah see so this time i can i could have you know change the text to mr is not found okay but uh, don't worry and because our intention is to you know replace this with raghavan so we will see the content of this file again see it has replaced so i hope uh, i mean this concept was clear and you have learned from this video and um, if so please do uh, subscribe to my channel and uh, if you have not and share it with your friends and also share the feedback in comment section and i will see you in next video till then keep learning and thanks for watching